And in this video, we are going to be resolving a AC compressor idler pulley issue that I think is the main reason a lot of people get noises when uh, their AC kicks on with their Subarus, or even if you're not having your AC on, you can still be making noise. And so the issue is, and I've already got my car apart here, but just to show you, because you can see more easily uh, what's going on is your AC belt, the thing that connects the AC compressor to the actual uh, crankshaft, and this is the harmonic balancer for this motor. Um, this thing needs to have an idler pulley on it, and the purpose of this idler pulley my finger on it right now is to make sure that uh, basically this belt is appropriately tensioned because the way you tension it is by uh, torquing this uh, bolt down um, after you've released the lock nut. But anyways, the issue is that the idler pulley itself, as you can hear, the bearings start to give out. This car has about 160,000 miles on it. So, um, you know, when this thing is spinning at 2000 RPM and you know, there's a little bit of play in this bearing as well. It's a big issue and that's very likely to be a reason that you are hearing as much noise. So resolving it means taking the fan guard out. I've taken the radiator out, but you don't need to take the radiator out. Um, and then there's these two uh, 12 mil bolts right here that you're gonna take out. And then um, this whole metal bra bracket will come off. So um, take all these belts out. And then uh, the other belt you need to take off before though is the power steering alternator. Uh, belt and uh, there's videos on YouTube you can watch to, to get that but um, this one is once you've gotten to this point you've got the belts all taken off um, that's what I'm gonna pick up in this video so you can just see uh, how easy it is to actually replace this pulley because it's, it's really not that bad um, so I'm just gonna put this camera up to the tripod so you guys can hopefully see some of what's going on and I've already loosened it just for the sake of uh, this video just so you can see what's going on um, the other important thing is the replacement pulley, at least for this Subaru, it's a 2006 Forester, is a Gates 38030. Um, hopefully the camera can pick that up, but basically this thing was, I think, 29 bucks on Amazon, so very cheap. Um, also feels more reliable than the uh, one that came out, ironically. Um, so it looks like Subaru kind of used this weird plastic pulley, but, you know, the bearings are NSK, so it's definitely not super low quality, but yeah, this is very likely what's the cause of these issues. So there's one 12 mil bolt, and these are both the same length, so you don't need to worry about it. This is the other 12 mil bolt, and then this bracket comes out like so. And just want to make sure you guys can see. So, this is what the bracket looks like. Um, here's our new idler pulley. It's very simple to install. You just are going to completely remove the uh, lock nut. Take that off, this thing lifts up and away. And then you lift up on the pulley to expose uh, the little thing that holds it to the actual bracket. So this thing, as you can hear, moorings, the bearing is bad, making a lot of noise. So that's garbage. Um, if you wanted to, you could potentially replace just the bearing itself and not the whole pulley. Um, I couldn't find the actual size for these, so it's a lot easier to just replace the pulley itself, uh, including the bearing. So, um, this is a Gates pulley, so high quality, uh, not really too concerned about it breaking. Um, and then we're just going to come in here and sit this guy into there like so. And then, uh, trying to keep it more or less organized, you just kind of seat it over the old stuff. Put it on the new lock nut, only finger tight because you do need this thing to be able to uh, go up and down for when you're tensioning it. And now we can just install this back in the car and uh, that's it. And so you can hear also how much quieter this thing is. So uh, this will resolve your issues for the uh, noises that you've been hearing. And I hope this helps. Thank you all for watching and take care.